Hello everybody, my name is Glaze 2 and before we start this video, just a quick note, uh, I had my microphone muted, uh, for all of this recording, so, uh, if things seem a little, uh, off timing, like my words don't match up with my actions in game, uh, that's why, just, uh, just, just letting you know, uh, yeah, I'm an idiot sometimes, but I got the, but I got the video, so, eh, that works. Hello guys, my name's Glaze Haze 2, and today I'm going to be showing you how to stealth Art Gallery, which is also Framing Frame Day 1, on Death Sentence 1 Down difficulty in Payday 2. For our assets in pre-planning, we will be getting roof access under additional mission equipment, so we can get onto the roof from a truck, and we will, getting, we will be getting Entry Point in Hall D, which can be used obviously as an Entry Point, as well as Cover, again, also under additional mission equipment and all that jazz. Uh, under Insider Help, you'll get the keycard in the bathroom stalls. And for surveillance, we'll get a spy cam in Hall C. Right there. Okay, that's all the pre-planning. And for your loadout, you should get a good stealth loadout. I'll have my recommended one in the top right corner for your viewing convenience. But, other than that, let's just get right into it. The first thing you want to do when you get into the heist is run up to the front doors and shoot them open like that, and like that. We will then enter and immediately exit, because this prevents the 15% chance of the bathroom guard spawning uh, at this doorway right here, uh, when you're lock picking it. So we will then pick the lock, and grab the key card right next to the toilet. toilet. We'll then head up onto the roof and start looking for two things. The first is, well not two, three. The first, some lasers, the paintings, and the security office. The lasers can spawn in any of the doorways, but if a guard is walking through one, they will be turned off. As you can see, there are the lasers, and here comes a guard, and they turn off. We will then want to look for the security office, which can spawn right over... Here, here, as it did in this uh, case, it could also spawn there, but it didn't because, you know, the one's in Hall E, and it can also spawn here, but, you know, it didn't because, again, it spawned in Hall E. We will then go over here and make sure we don't get caught by guards because they can see through the skylight, wait for a safe time, open it up, and then land on either this middle bit or, if you can somehow make it, those little... Uh, pedestal things. Open this up, get the guard to notice you, surrender him, and shoot him into a corner. We will then answer his pager. This is a good time to note that the place where you want to shoot the guard will differ between room layouts, uh, with the one in Hall C being an easier layout to hide the body in. You can pick up some courier packages if you want to, and then we'll start looking for paintings. Of course, making sure to not be spotted by guards, some of which are marked. Keep looking for paintings. Oh, there's one. Oh, there's one. Uh, and there's no more in Hall E, so make a mental note that Hall E is clear. I do that. You can also type in chat if you have other people playing. Or if you're on a call with someone, you can just tell them, of course. I'll then run over here and secure the painting. Then we can go clear out Hall D or any other hall by going, uh, silly me jumped off there, uh, going up here and getting onto the roof, which is easier than heading all the way back over to the staircase. You can use the skylights to scout for paintings and look for the sold stickers, and there's the entry point, which you can use for cover. As you can see, that one does not have a sold sticker. Now is this that one, then that one doesn't have one either, no, I didn't see that there, neither, neither is that one, and that one doesn't either, nope, no sold sticker, no sold sticker, and no sold sticker. This is a pretty good scenario actually because Hall D is pretty hard to clear, uh, even using the entry point as cover, but yeah, 
we will then head over to Hall C. And looking down, we can try and notice any paintings. You can, as I said before, uh, I'll mention that later. And an entry point can also randomly spawn if you need to know that. Making sure the guards don't see you, of course. We can use six cents to mark some, and then hop into the uh, skylight in a second here. If there is not an entry point in Hall C, you can land on, as I said before, that little entry point. Uh, looks like it would hurt, but it doesn't, so we're just going to make sure there's no guards. Look around for paintings, as you can see that uh, devil one, whatever the heck it is, is got a sold sticker. That one right there also does too. And all the other inside ones, such the devil one, have any uh, inside that little thing. I can't really see any sold stickers for the outside ones from here, so they might have some, they might not, I'm not sure. Uh, but the inside ones I can see pretty clearly, and they don't appear to have any. So, as I said before, we're going to wait for the guards to clear out. And I'm going to take this time to go down into the bathroom to clear out some guards a little bit. Uh, you can use these hand dryers as distractions to lure guards in here. Uh, and then you can kill them, answer pages, bag the bodies, and bring them over okay. to the van. So, I'll just fast forward this part and see you guys at the end of it. Okay, with that over with, uh probably a good time to explain a uh, quick note if you answer four pagers an inspector will spawn and come up onto the roof so and in a moment you'll see a strategy that I use that throws paintings onto the roof so you'll want to avoid uh, either keeping them up there for too long or uh, killing another guard I've saved the pager here in just in case something bad happens uh, and if something bad does happen and you've got like four out of six uh, what is it paintings, you can quickly uh, secure them. And here's the strategy I said about throwing paintings up there. Uh, if you aim in the right spot, you can get these paintings through the roof. Uh, I'm a bit rusty, but there we go. You can grab uh, another painting. You can grab all the paintings. Uh, this only works in Hall C, E, and A though, because if you throw them from B or D, you'll just go into the next room and that won't be good because guards will probably see them. Okay. Oh my goodness. <sighs> too high, too low. Too high again. And there we go. Okay. Then, because I know there's lasers uh, blocking C and B from each other, I will run out through the washrooms. By making sure these guards see me, please don't come over here. No, there's another guard coming. Gotta run. Okay, that was pretty close, but eh, it worked. Okay, then I'm gonna go up here and secure those paintings because I've finished one section that has been sectioned off by uh, the lasers. Uh, and as you note, uh, as you can see, not as you note, I'm gonna note that. Thank you very, thank you very much. Um, yeah, I got three paintings from Hall C, which means I'm at four to six, so 
as I said earlier, if something goes wrong, I have the ability... Oh, damn it. I have the ability to... What is it? Yeah, ECM rush and get out. As long as nothing stupid happens, like me mistiming, placing my ECM. And then, you know, Patriot going off, because that's not good. And yes, it has happened to me. This is like my... Oh. This is like my sixth time playing this heist, but eh, whatever. Anyway, four out of six paintings, which means that the rest of them are separated in A and B. So I'm gonna go in. <laughs> nah. Excuse me. I'm gonna go in through the roof, because that's usually better now that I think about it, and grab those paintings. Oh, no. Uh, should I go in through the. Yeah, I'm going in through here. Screw it. No, nope, I'm not. Ha, tricked you. Uh, yes, as you can tell, this is a voiceover, as I said in the beginning. Uh, I don't actually remember what I did. Uh, I don't know why I didn't take the truck entry point. That was weird. Anyway. Over here. Open this. Make sure there's nobody down there. Oh, that was close. And get on the entry point, grab this painting. And as I stated earlier, throw it through this window. Ah, nice. First try. Let's go find some more. Oh, there's another one. Uh huh. Up there. Ah, missed this time. I'll get it. Man, what a beautiful arch. Okay, make sure there's nobody else here. Uh, I know there's nobody else coming through at least Hall B because I've got a spy cam, which is really nice, really nice. Okay, it appears that the rest of the paintings are in Hall B. There's a guard over here, so I'm gonna be careful. I'm gonna grab this. Uh, throw it through the window again. Ah, oh, what a nice arch. I am so good at doing this. Uh, so I know there's a guard over there, so I'm gonna be pretty careful. As I mentioned earlier, I know there's a guard there. Uh, he's not coming through here, so... I'm gonna go over here and look in. Nobody's coming in through the lobby. Don't see anybody over there. Looks good. Doesn't look like anything to write. Don't see anybody to the left. Oh, there he is. Mark him, grab the painting, and get the heck out of there. Then, oh... Check in my back, throw that through there, and the last painting has to be in Hall B as well. Is he coming over here? Oh, he's coming over here, gotta go over here. And go through here, I know there's nobody else coming because of my spy cam. Gonna find the painting, and no, oh, no, there it is. Uh, as you might have seen there, some of these paintings are wa rather uh, tasteful? I don't know what you would call that. Uh, but luckily for me, uh, the sun said so. Hopefully I don't have to do anything about that. Anyway, yeah, I've got the last painting. The rest are on the roof. I'm gonna go secure this, get the rest of the paintings, and that will have been all. Again, this is like the third time I've said this. If you're at 4 out of 6, 5 out of 6, maybe in th 3 out of 6 if you're fast and lucky, you can get all the paintings out if something goes terribly, terribly wrong. And, again, the inspector spawns at 4 pages, so if you keep one just in case, then you can avoid him. Until, of course, you answer the fourth pager. But yeah, that's been everything. That's uh, How to Self Art Gallery in Payday 2 on the Sense 1 Down difficulty. Uh, I've been Glaze Hayes 2. And yeah, like and subscribe and all that jazz. Uh, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! That's how you do it, friends! Expertly done! Collectors will pay big figures for this stuff. You did great, gang.